system. 38 watt Dr. Z mass is the focus of the rig. This one is the wet end. And for crunch rhythms I got the Marshall JCM 2000 running dry. Push between amps and pedals I'm using the GCX and ground control by Voodoo Lab. So I got my all my analog pedals in a rack drawer here. For the lead loop running the MXR carbon copy delay and the barber direct drive to drive the tubes of the amp give it a little bit of overdrive and sometimes throw in this uh, boss compressor for a little bit of sustain and to really punch it out there on my huge solos I got the line driver MXR as well also powering it with the pedal power 2 plus nice and quiet on the pedal board, I got the Ground Control Pro by Voodoo Lab. This sends the signal MIDI for the back of the GCX, which is in the rack. And you can switch your pedals and amps at the same time in one loop. So I got the lead, and Marshall Dry, pretty much four presets for right now, and you have instant access. Right next to it, I got the Morley Bad Horsey Wah. Really easy and quick, automatic. Uh, Boss tuner, of course. And the Voodoo Lab Pedal Power 2 Plus. Very quiet. So, this is my number one guitar. It's a 60 reissued. Got stock pickups. Sorry, my list for himself. Next, we got the slash signature, which um, it's a little bit hotter because it's got the Alnico 2 Pros. It's like really warm. I like this a lot. This is the Explorer Gibson gave me. Pretty cool. I use it for a lot of heavy stuff like drop D. It's got that metal sound. This guitar right here, it's a Gibson Melody Maker. Uh, when I was nine, I uh, won America's Most Talented Kids, and this is one of the prizes. Signed, got it signed by Joe Bonamassa when I opened for him. Here's my Strat. Uh, it's pretty good for fast stuff. I uh, play it every once in a while. I was signed by Buddy Guy when he called me up to jam with him. Up here I got my acoustics. Um, this is my uh, Taylor T5. Uh, plays like an electric. Very easy to play. It's got the uh, five way switch on it too. You can get like an electric sound and really like nice acoustic sounds too. Here is my Taylor 312. Uh, really big and warm sound out of this. Really dig this. That's about it. This is my guitar tech world over here. Uh, use big bands and nut sauce. Uh, helps my guitar stay in tune a lot. Uh, it's my shrub capos. And these D Markley strings, blue steels, and they're acoustic. Alchemy. Once again, I'd like to thank Gibson, D. Markley Strings, Seymour Duncan, Shrub Capos, Big Benz, 
Weedy Leather Straps, and Voodoo Lab for hooking me up. Thanks for watching. For more information, you can check me out at grantaustintaylor.com. Thank <laughs> you.